Are you serious? Are you serious? What? Dennis Rodman may be going to pull off a miracle. That's right. The NBA star Dennis Rodman has contacted North Korea's leader Kim Jong-un and has sent him a tweet on Twitter asking him to, to set Kenneth Bay, the U.S. citizen who is being held in North Korea, who is sentenced to 15 years hard labor. Rodman has asked Kim Jong-un to cut him loose. Quote, I'm calling on the supreme leader of North Korea, or as I call him, Kim, to do me solid and cut Kenneth Bay loose. Unquote. Dennis Rodman's tweet to Kim Jong-un. Are you serious? Now this report's coming in both by UPI's reporting as well as CNN. And uh, we know that this K Kenneth Bay, who was born in South Korea, but he's an American citizen from Washington State, r operates a tour guide company taking people in and out of North Korea. He's been doing it for years. He was charged with espionage and sentenced to 15 years hard labor. Well, we have a report come in yesterday uh, on the Christian News. I want to thank Nick of New York for good research here. Also, Nick got this article to me, that yesterday in the Christian News, that the American Christian that has been detained in North Korea is set to appear before the nation's Supreme Court and may face the death penalty. Reports are, his crime... He's being charged and accused of attempting to overthrow the North Korean government. What? He can't do it. What? You know this guy wasn't trying to overthrow the North Korean government. So he's a pawn. He's being dangled. And Dennis Rodman, who we know already been to North Korea and struck a friendship up with Kim Jong-un when he was over there for a few days traveling with the Globetrotters. They even went out, hung out, had had... Uh, watched a basketball game together and hung out and had dinner at the presidential palace. And Kim and, and Dennis Rodman calls him his friend. Now what Dennis is doing, he's asking for some a favor here. He's saying, hey, do me solid, man. Cut this man loose. What? So who knows? The Lord works in mysterious ways. And there's a lot of people praying for Kenneth Bay to be set free. And you know what? God can do it. He can do, he's done many things. I mean, he has absolutely used many ways of setting people free and delivering all throughout the Bible. We know these are true. So it's just, who knows? Maybe, just maybe, maybe Dennis Rodman could be used to spare a life and even bring better relationship between the United States and North Korea. Get a cup of coffee and just ponder. Let's just, let's meditate on it. I'm done meditating. It could happen. It actually could happen. I, I, God, it's up to the Lord, please. In Jesus' name. Well, let's just pray that this young man, Kenneth Bay, does get set free. Whether Dennis Rodman has anything to do with it or not, let's just pray that he does get to come home. If you're not saved, give your life to Jesus Christ. I've got a lot to talk about today. We've got some powerful information and some breaking news coming out of the Middle East as it relates to the peace process. And again, some very unlikely players are getting involved. And I'll be right back to tell you about that in just a minute. God bless you. In Jesus' name.